Want to see something real and amazing? This is a blue tang, an increasingly popular marine fish. According to marine animal experts, the only source for blue tangs is taking them from the wild. And that could become a real problem. Every time I go into a fish store and I see some little kid buying a blue tang, I know that that fish came from you know, some reef in Indonesia or the Philippines, and we don't know what that means for the wild environment. To solve this real problem, researchers are working on an amazing solution. So if we can provide a captive bred alternative, we would have, be having a much smaller impact on the reefs. Real are the threats to coral reefs and tropical fish, like ocean acidification, pollution, and overexploitation. Amazing is the work being done by researchers like Kevin Barden. The Rising Tide Conservation Program, in partnership with organizations like SeaWorld, is working to breed marine fish like the blue tang in human care. It's not easy, but SeaWorld is committed to helping find a way. Fellow researchers at the Oceanic Institute of Hawaii Pacific University recently were successful in breeding yellow tangs in human care. And Kevin visited to learn how to apply their accomplishments to breeding blue tangs. Since that trip to Hawaii, we've actually been able to push the blue tangs a little bit farther than we ever had before. So we think that collaboration is really important and that's a big part of Rising Tide. We have a fairly good idea of what it's going to take to get them to push all the way through. So we feel like we're close. Learn more about the real, amazing work being done by Rising Tide conservation scientists to help blue tanks and other marine fish like them.